Hey everyone, so tonight I'm doing a review on Quicksil the Marvel Legends Quicksilver from the Blob Wave. This is a pretty cool figure. I do hope one day we get a updated figure just because I think it would be nice to have one that has the newer um, Hasbro molds. Um, these are still cool, but it is the only uh, Quicksilver um, we have. So hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed with all the X-Men coming out that maybe he is uh, coming down the pipeline. So let him finish up his 360. We'll check out the details. All right, guys, so checking out the details. I think he's got a cool head sculpt. Um, this is definitely older Hasbro, so you can see that the flesh tone is very, very pale. Uh, it's more of just like just the shade of the plastic. There's not much, uh, just a very light plastic. But he's looking straight on. He's got the blue eyes, white eyebrows, and he's got the more swooshed back hair. Uh, it's just painted white. Looks cool. I mean, you can definitely tell it's Quicksilver. <laughs> But the rest of the body is just that lighter blue, and he's got the white uh, kind of lightning stripes, you know, on the sides here and around the belt buckle, around the belt waistline. It looks good, nice and cleanly painted. I mean, it's a very plain, very plain figure. Um, coming down here, he's got the white, just the white uh, gloves, and then it continues that light blue along the rest of the body. No black wash or anything like that. And then it's got the white uh, boots there. So you can just kind of check them out. It's kind of weird looking at the older Hasbro and seeing how like, you can see how wobbly he is. He's not actually loose at the waist, it's just extra room so you can kind of slide him back and forth. It's just kind of funny looking at these older Hasbro uh, body molds. All right, so I'm gonna go over the articulation. So his head looks up, that's about as far. Looks down, that much. And he looks left and right. Got ball, is that the arm, older armpit joints there? Got balls in the arms, move out. And down, forward, and back. Got an upper bicep swivel, double jointed elbows. It's got the forearm articulation, hinge at the joint, no weight, no joint uh, swivel. It's got the hand flap articulation here. This one has actually had used some of the Toy Biz molds and used their finger articulation. You can crunch forward very far and crunch his back about that much. And they did continue the paint up in there. Got a waist swivel. These are the old Y joints, and they kind of see they get kind of at the finale with them. You can move them forward. Ugh, this one's kind of stuck. But you can kind of see they have that little joint in there. You can move forward and back, and then you have to rotate it to make them do the splits. Mine's just kind of stuck here. It's got the upper thigh swivel, double jointed knees. It's got the boot rotation, and the hinges move down, and they move up. You got the old school ankle rocker. You can see it there. And no peg holes to bond the feet with the toe articulation. <laughs> it always interesting. All right, I'll show you guys how tall Quicksilver is. All right, guys, so Quicksilver stands. We're at the around the six inch mark. He's not completely standing up straight, so I believe he's around six inches just because those Y joints are not working with me. And I'm going to bring in the variant, which is the healings in green. So you can see them next to each other. Let's scoot him on over so you can. Uh, Little turd. <laughs> there we go. So you can kind of see the difference between them. Same, I mean, same head sculpt. It's literally just a green body um, swapped in place of the yellow. I mean, of the blue. What am I saying? Yellow. <laughs> but this is actually a cool figure. I mean, I've been using him for like a villain, uh, sitting him with uh, like Magneto and stuff with the green suit. So that's kind of what I've been using him for. But it's just a um, green plastic. There's not really any. Uh, Pearlization or anything like that to make it really shiny. But you can kind of see them. Look how the white hair, you can't even see it. There we go. I mean, there we go. You guys can kind of see them together. But there you go, guys. That's my review on the Hasbro Blob Wave uh, Quicksilver. Um, please leave a comment, hit the like button, and subscribe if you haven't. All right. Thanks, guys. Take care.